Good morning, everybody. Ah, sounds of nature. Well, it's day two here. We are in Springfield, Missouri. We made it in one piece with uh, very few complications. And it was a good evening. It was nice to get here, get unpacked. The cabins are good. The kids love the bunk beds here at uh, the KOA in Springfield, Missouri. The only thing I'd say was the negative was that the uh, queen bed that me and Tegan slept on was not great. The mattress is kind of rough. So hopefully uh, uh, other cabins along the way will have improved mattresses. But nonetheless, we're in day two. So today we go from Springfield, Missouri, pit stop in Oklahoma City, and then push on to Amarillo, Texas by evening. So it's gonna be another fun-filled day of long car travels, but this is the last long traveling day. After this point, we'll have, uh, we, we've limited it to about four hours per day that we do need to travel from one location to the next. hit the zero, zero mile to empty mark, but we were able to make it to the gas station. Now, from Wisconsin, we have the quick trip line of gas stations, which we're familiar with. And of course, it's spelled K-W-I-K. Well, here, we're starting to see a second chain called quick trip, but it's spelled Q-U-I-K. So even though there's two gas station chains with the same name, neither one of them have gotten the proper spelling yet. So our working theory is that there must be somewhere in the continental United States, a third chain of gas stations called Quick Trip, but they've got the market cornered on the correct spelling. So if you know of this gas station chain, let us know because I'd be curious to know where they can be found. Anyhow, we got gas, we had a little bit of a break, we did some stretch, and now we're gonna keep pushing on to Oklahoma City pretty cool and now it's a Sunday afternoon we were talking to a few uh, locals semi locals and they were saying it's pretty common for the city to be like dead like it is today um, on Sundays so even out here towards the west uh, you get a little more of that old-fashioned culture where they shut things down on Sunday but the city is super clean um, there's a brand new building well it started in 2015 the Bach building um, it's uh, it was started in 2015, completed in 2018, and that's uh, 430 feet high. And then this building, the one that I showed you earlier, I'm not sure what that building is. I'll look it up and we'll get back to you with the footage on that, but that's definitely at least another 300 feet on top of that. But these uh, botanical gardens here are beautiful. Um, we were only able to go to the outside part today, and they just went ahead and shut the doors now because it's a little slippery. But uh, very, very nice. Nice city, nice and clean. Uh, first impression is I like it. So now we're gonna get some ice cream and then keep on pushing through, try and make Amarillo by evening. 